Okay, so this is uh, from the double stick type. And this is the speaker wire. Just a regular speaker wire. As you can see, one, one conductor of the speaker wire is uh, white. The other one is uh, copper color. So that's how you can tell. Okay, it's got a white stripe. What I'm going to do is, this is what I'm considering the midpoint, even though it's not the middle. I'm going to fold this and put a half twist in the wire so that a uh, striped wire is going to be paired with a non-striped wire. Okay. And then I'm going to work these twists out all the way to the end and use this to start the coil in the middle. And that way I'll have a striped wire paired with a non-striped wire. And what that'll do is that'll make two uh, two Biffler wound coils, one on top of the other. So, figure twice this. Right? It gives me a little bit of space there. Without having too much bunched up. Just look and make sure I've got there it should be on the top here. Okay. So that's the way I want to start it. Alright, so what we're gonna do is go ahead and uh, just wrap this around here temporarily. When I'm done, I'll bring the uh, connections out. Okay, you see the stripe is on the bottom of the inner one and on the top of the outer one. And that's what the coils look like stacked on top of each other. Okay, so I just measured the, uh, the distance here of the leftover and uh, found out that winding a coil this size, uh, the long leg only eat up an additional five and a half inches. So. That's why I didn't have enough here, is because I allowed too much uh, for consumption by the longer leg.